So this is Brandon Harris with TheUrbanGeek.com and I am going to have an iPad uh, case fight. Okay, so uh, this is the official Apple iPad case. This is the one that we saw Steve Jobs gushing over um, during his demo. Um, it's pretty good. It's pretty cool. It's a nice microfiber feel to it. Uh, what's bad about it is it seems to pick up a lot of gray kind of dust, fingerprints, um, but it does feel good to the touch. Uh, so there's a couple different form factors in which you can have this. So if I wanted to sit it at a nice angle where I could type things, I'd put it in this triangle uh, position right here. And I could just type very easily sitting on a desk and sitting over the iPad. Also, this is a kind of cool thing too to put on your desk. I had a couple of apps today uh, that had some really cool scenery. Uh, I put this on my desk and I could look at some pretty cool scenery every now and then. Even the picture slideshow is pretty cool as well to have in this mode. Um, also, you can put it in this mode as well too, long face pretty good uh, so overall good case I think it feels a little flimsy at some times but if it's, it's a good compact case just to walk around with uh, if you don't need to put anything inside of your book bag and you want to hold your iPad and have easy access to it I definitely recommend this case it's definitely well suited for the iPad iPhone or I'm, I'm sorry iPad and uh, you can tell me they, they really made this fit snugly because it's hard as hell to get out sometimes so let me get this out and I will show you another um, case that I ended up buying for this guy. Um, this is the end case convertible, I think, flip jacket or something like that. It is listed on Apple's website. I actually bought this inside the store. Um, what's interesting is that I went to two other Apple stores after this one and they did not get this particular case in. Um, what I like about this is that it's really easy to get your iPod, iPad inside of it. It slips in very easily and it keeps it very nice and securely covered. This is a thick faux leather outside um, and the killer feature on this, and I guess that's why they call it the convertible, um, it has a couple of different ways where it opens up and it will sit at different viewing angles. There's these little grooves right here that allow it to sit at different viewing angles. So I can have it a little bit more upright, further down right, and then further down right again and it usually does not slip. Sometimes well, just slipped right there. I didn't really get it in the groove. Um, I think this is a good case. I'd recommend this to anybody that really wanted some good comfort and security uh, for your iPad because it's not going anywhere here. One of the things that I did notice about this case that I do not like is that when you have it in this position for an amount of time, your iPad starts to kind of slip out rather easily. Apple did a really good job with their case because they had this guard installed where you could flip it under your iPad and it would not slip out the other opposite end when you were sitting it upright. So overall, I would recommend both of these. They both serve two different purposes. This one is a good, I'm throwing you on my book bag case. I don't want you to get beat up. And this is a great, I want to walk around town, flip you open and play with you whenever I feel like it. Um, so overall, I'd recommend both of them um, for two different reasons. Uh, this is Brandon Harris with TheUrbanGeek.com. Uh, thanks for viewing us.